work for you on the defensive side? Oh, yeah, that's something I pride myself in. I feel like uh, that's what's going to get me into the league, playing defense, being versatile defensively. So, yeah. What do you think about the experience, like meeting Magic and that type of thing? Oh, this is a great experience. Just to be in this, this building, this facility, getting a, getting a chance to meet uh, some, some legends here, uh, it's just a blessing for me. What do you think about the attention your hair gets? A lot of, a lot of people have written about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It gets a lot of attention. Uh, I mean, hey, it is what it is. I... <laughs> Someone called it iconic in a story that I read. Oh, yeah. It, or, or is that you? No, I, no, it's like, it's iconic. It's iconic. You go back to TCU. Uh, yeah, my, my cut is uh, iconic, sir. Kendrick, you're kind of a stat stuffing type of type of guy. Yes, sir. Do you feel like you want to show off your all around game, or do you feel that, like you need to show off specific parts that you know that are strengths versus uh, just doing a little bit of everything? Yeah, well, in this in this situation, it's kind of hard to show really what you can do in, in one on one, uh, two on two, and everything like that. So. I try to focus on what I can do best is, is rebounding and playing defense, and then all the other things that fall into place, like shooting and passing and stuff. So, do you feel like you have a, an advantage as maybe an older prospect than some of the other guys that are? Oh, yeah, I definitely do. Uh, I'm 23. December, I'm going to be 24. Uh, I'm more mature. I feel like I'm ready to play in, a, in the NBA right now. Um, and I, um, that's about it. How'd Mo look out there today? Who? Mo. Oh, he looked good. He looked good. He he showed uh, he can shoot it. He showed a nice touch around the rim, and, and he's a he's a competitor. So, yeah. How would you summarize what Magic and Luke had to say? To uh, they just told us keep working hard, take advantage of every opportunity we get. Uh, each workout, um, he he basically told us uh, find what you can do best, specialize at that, and and work on other parts of your game. So I took a lot of knowledge from uh, Magic and Luke. You know your plan for how many more workouts that you might have on your best so far? Yeah, I got a, I got like 11 more workouts set up until the draft. So I did already, I already did like six. So. What stands out, if anything, about this workout? What's different? What's similar to the other one? Mm, I mean, they're all pretty much the same. It's a lot of a lot of shooting, uh, a lot of competitive one uh, one on one. Um, this was different because at the end of the end of the the. Uh, the workout we did the shooting drill full court. Uh, I haven't did that in a workout yet, so that was that's probably what legs, stood out. Legs a little guys. Yeah, 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 kind of, yeah. That's part of the point. I guess. Yeah, yes, sir. How'd you do in that part? I didn't do all. I didn't do too good, uh, but sorry. Right. Not sure anyone does good. Yeah, <laughs> somebody got 28, so somebody somebody must have did real good. <laughs> what kind of drills did they put you through? Uh, we did first. We did um, finishing drills. Uh, we did a lot of a lot of shooting, spot up shooting. We did some off the dribble shooting, uh, one on ones, uh, two on two, full court, uh, full court, two on two, full court, three on three, and uh, at the end we shot. We shot a lot. Got a lot of shots up. Anything else, guys? Sorry, one more. Just what's the one thing that you would want to keep focusing on this summer is it to show that you're at the that kind of the NBA caliber player that you think you're pretty good at? Uh, I think I just want to get my, my my shooting consistent. I want to be a consistent three point shooter. Um, I feel like if I get that uh, consistently, I think I can I can have a, a long career in the NBA.